Perfect. All right, so this is going to be a quick tutorial on how to assign textures to your 3D animation rig. So first thing that you want to do is make sure that you are in the right um, a viewing space. So usually when your uh, display is on, it's on four or five, sorry, five. Six is going to add your shaders as well. And uh, this is the option without light. So this is five or six, I believe, seven, 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 seven. So seven is going to give you a silhouette. I like to use the number seven on the keyboard to look at my silhouettes. Uh, this is really, really good for posing. But for the sake of this, uh, we're simply going to use six. So um, let me make sure Carnot's on so we can see the keys that I pressed. Perfect. OK, so first thing I'm going to do, uh, you have a couple options. We can quickly go to, um, I believe it is uh, reference editor. works okay so uh, first thing we're going to do is we're going to go into our hyper shade window go ahead and click on that now what we have here is um, already these these pre-made textures that have already been assigned to our character but as you can see there is no actual texture on them so first thing we're gonna do is um, let me make this incredibly, incredibly fast. So this is the head material. So right now I am currently looking at a material that has already been assigned to my character. But as you can tell, I cannot see that material at all. So what probably happened is that my material got disconnected or broken from the actual file. So to fix that, as you can see, we already have this little indication box that says that we have already assigned a color. But as you can see, there is no color. All we have to do is simply find that color. So I'm going to double click on that. And as you can tell right here, this is where the animation rig is trying to find that diffuse diffuse is the texture that we will be using so let's double click on that folder and we're basically just going to look for that folder and if i'm not mistaken let's go to downloads it should be in my downloads um, and it should be wherever you place your file format so um, my file is in the download folder generally speaking i would put this in its own animation rig folder but for the sake of this exercise we're just going to click on this so I'm going to double click. Now it should be under textures. If it's not under textures, it's generally under images. So let's click on textures and perfect. We have our diffuses here. Now, if I'm not mistaken, the diffuse we are looking for is for the head. So yes, looking at here, we have the head uh, deformer or sorry, the head diffuse, which is right here. Let me go ahead and double click on that and boom, automatically it has been assigned along with my other um, textures as well. So uh, to be honest, I was not expecting that. Generally speaking, I have to um, take them all from scratch, but uh, perfect. Here is another great example of, uh, actually no, that's really what Baby Yoda's eyes look like, my bad. Super. Okay, so um, yeah, that's it. Honestly, that was way faster than I thought it was going to be. Thank you, Maya 2022. Um, I can see that uh, the textures were automatically assigned, but really quickly, I will do that again just so that you can all see really quick. So uh, let me again open up a new scene. And actually, we'll, we'll call that done for the sake of this video. Uh, I'll maybe edit this. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> You'll find out when you watch it. But uh, let me do this again 
without the recording.